This is the second of three videos in the Creating Conferences series. When you open a new conference, the default view is a single pane list view where the messages are delivered. You can customize the look of your conference by splitting your conference into two and adding an image to either of the two panes or both and use one section to create subfolders or conferences that may be related to the master conference. To split a conference into two panes, you can choose View, Split, and choose either Horizontal or Vertical. Once split, you can click on either pane and choose to view one of them by icon, scaled icon, or list view. We're going to set our top view by icon and use it for subconferences or folders. You can set the image on one of the panes by right-clicking on the pane and choosing Change View Properties, and then on the Background tab, click on Use Picture, and then select from the list of available images. The list will be a list of all images that your logged in settings file has already seen. You can choose to tile the image and make any text or messages on folders transparent. If you want to have one of your own custom images, you can upload them to the Rules folder of the conference. You can create JPEG or PNG images matching the size of the window that you wish to apply the images to. Here, for example, we have two images. The JPEG image will be used untiled for the top pane, and the PNG image will be used on the lower pane, tiled to give a shaded edge along the left. Note that the image itself is wide so that when tiled, the white portion to the right is wide enough so as not to repeat the blue edge within the conference view. Choose Collaborate, Rules to open the Rules folder and drag and drop your images into that folder. If we look for these images in the View Properties now, they won't be there. The image will only be recognized and merged with your settings file when you open the conference for the first time. So close it and open it one more time. Now you can open your View Properties once more and go to the Background tab and select your new image and apply the change. Let's click on the top pane and choose conference bg.jpg as an untiled image with transparent text for the top portion. Let's click on the lower pane and choose the blue underscore side dot png image as a tiled image with transparent text for the lower pane. You can explore some of the other view properties on the display tab and choose a different font, size, and color for the column text. And even show vertical and horizontal grid lines for an added effect. Here we see what the finished conference looks like with some added areas and some content. Be sure to watch the other two videos in this series to understand how to create and manage the view properties of your conferences.